In this video, we're gonna learn how to edit your cart page. So if you have an online shop through Wix, this is gonna be a super easy way to get to your settings here. So what you're gonna do is when you're in the Wix editor, go to menus and pages, and you're gonna to go to your store pages here, and you'll see the cart page right here. So when you open it in the editor, it says cart is empty, continue shopping. That's just kind of generic because you are in the editor. So that's what you'll see. However, to adjust some of the settings of what your customers will see, you'll just click settings. And here you'll have like your main uh, settings, design and text. So um, up here in the main, it's really interesting and important for you to remember too. They do show that if you wanna see what a full cart looks like, that you need to preview your site add an item to the cart and then go to the cart and click back to editor. So um, that's how you can see what your settings look like. Just because right now the way that their editor is set up, it's not something that you can visually see the changes that you're making until you go into a preview of your site. So um, to adjust some settings here, depending on the look and feel that you want, you can go to settings. Um, you can show uh, what's displayed if you want taxes, if there's delivery rates, you can add a note in there if you want. Um, you can have a continue shopping link. So you can show the link and if you want it to go to a certain page or a different web address, you know, whatever you want, you can click here and you can redirect them to like continue shopping. So on this one, what we'd probably do is we'd have them go to shop, you know, cause that's the main shop page here. You could do that instead of having it linked to home. Um, if you go over to design, this is, you know, if you want your cart the full width of the page, that really only affects when you're on desktop version. Uh, you could change the background of it from white and, you know, if you want different divider colors, if you want the text to be different, you can go for the titles and the body. You can go here and you can pick a different text. You can't adjust the size of it. And I think that's just because it's very, um, strict on the carts because the way the payments processing, things like that, they don't want things to get confusing for customers. So right now, uh, editing as far as the cart is pretty limited just because it's very uh, procedural based as far as getting payments, things like that, and all the information that needs to be on there. So if you go to, you know, you can adjust the font, but the size and stuff that is determined by Wix, Buttons, if you want to adjust buttons and what they look like to make them match your site colors, you can do this. Um, the text on the buttons, so right now it's a black button with white text, uh, so you can adjust that as well. Um, if you go to text here, so this is just basically if you want it to say different things. So instead of my cart, if you have a fun name and say like, or you just want to say, you know, have if you have different names for things, you're welcome to edit them in here. So how says cart is empty or continue shopping and your promo code. So if you want have instructions or different ways that you want to word things, you can go here to text and adjust what they say. So that's just some of your basic settings for your cart. If you need to uh, manage payments, you can go here, um, but mostly your settings are going to pertain to the settings bar and what it'll look like. Again, to see what your settings look like, make sure you go up here to the right hand side where it says preview and add a sample of a product to your cart and then you'll be able to see what it looks like.